see some action video in the undersea movie theater. Manta means blanket in Spanish, and the manta ray's fins certainly look like a large blanket. They are strong enough so that the manta ray can use them to leap out of the water. Small fish will sometimes follow rays hoping to pick up scraps of food that the ray might leave behind when it is done eating. Of all the Earth's living reptiles, turtles are the most in danger of becoming extinct. That is why many countries have passed laws protecting them and their nesting sites. Turtles live most of their lives in the sea and only go ashore to make a nest and lay their eggs. They have powerful flippers which enable them to swim very quickly, but they are very clumsy walking on the ground. Today, turtles are in danger of becoming extinct. An octopus has no bones or shell. Thus it can reshape its body and squeeze into tiny holes and cracks between rocks. It can also change its color to blend into its surroundings. Moray eels come out of their hiding places in the rocks to hunt for food. Some people believe that they are poisonous, but that isn't true. However, when threatened, they can use their sharp fangs to inflict dangerous wounds.
sponges feed by filtering water through the pores and canals which pierce their bodies. They are extremely efficient and will extract almost every particle from the water, even creatures as small as bacteria. Stingrays get their name from the sharp poisonous barb in their tails. They use it as both an offensive and defensive weapon. They normally avoid contact with humans but will sting an unsuspecting swimmer if stepped on by accident. There are many kinds of reef environments. Some are in shallow, sunny water. Others are deeper and look more like caves. The coloring of this grouper helps it hide in the reef. The grouper can lurk in the shadows and small fish swimming by won't notice it until they are sucked into the grouper's large mouth. Tropical reefs are extremely rich in marine life. A single reef can be the home for thousands of different types of animals and plants. All the different creatures depend on each other, and if the presence of humans or pollution reduces the number of just one of those creatures, all the others will be affected. Fish which live on the reef are often brightly colored so that they blend in with the bright colors of anemones and coral. <laughs> 